Oz Ruiz here with Carlos the Solution Morales. Carlos, one of your good friends, Jesus Soto Caraz, fought to a draw against Yoshihiro Kamigai this past Friday at the Velasco Theater. How did you see that fight? Oh man, that fight was electrifying. You know, it was like, I never seen a fight like that live ever in my entire life. So it was a really good experience to see how the crowd was reacting to that, you know. And I want to please the crowd like Soto Caraz does, so it was just, it was a good, good fight. Did you get to talk to Jesus after the fight? No, I did not get to talk to him because, uh, you know, a lot of people were around him, so I didn't want to. Okay. Based on how the fans reacted once the scorecards were announced, do you think we'll be seeing a rematch soon? Definitely a rematch. That's going to be a maybe fight of the year candidate. Okay. Uh, it's been a couple of months since your last fight. You suffered a cut uh, over your right eye. Otherwise, you won convincingly on February 18th. When is the solution, Morales, ready for action again? You know, I, I, was, I was suspended 60 days after the two cuts that I had on my eyebrow. Uh, so I should be getting back in the ring by June or July latest. Okay. Um, one of the upcoming fights in the Super Featherweight division is Francisco Vargas against Orlando Salido on June 4th. Um, is there a chance you might be fighting on that card? Um, and probably, probably not. I, it's really up to the, uh, the matchmakers and, and Golden Boy pretty much. Okay. How do you see that fight shaping up, Vargas versus Salido? I see Vargas uh, winning or maybe stopping uh, Salido. What, why do you, what makes you think that he'll stop uh, Salido? You know, uh, Vargas is a younger fighter, you know, who throws a lot of punches. And I'm, I'm sure he's just going to overwhelm uh, Salido, who's also, you know, hard puncher, but I think uh, Vargas will take the victory that night. Mm -hmm. Vargas is a WBC super featherweight champ. Salido is a warrior that has been through so many uh, wars. Could this be a fight of the year candidate in your opinion? Yeah, definitely. It'd be another Soto Caraz and the Japanese guy. <laughs> <laughs> um, will 2016 be a year where we could see the Solution Morales fighting on an HBO card? I mean, you know, that's the goal for, for every fighter. But I mean, if it's, if it's 2016, I'll be happy. But if it's 2017, I'll still be happy. I mean, I just want to be ready when that moment comes, you know, okay. and be able to show HBO that, you know, I'm the real deal. Okay. Is that a wound on your right eye? Is it healing pretty well? Um, yes, according to the doctor, it's, uh, it's, it's healing properly, so I should be able to get back in the ring as soon as possible. Okay. Is there anything else you would like to say to your fans, uh, Carlos? Uh, you know, follow me on Instagram, uh, the Solution 1990 Twitter, uh, 1990, uh, and you know, don't, don't miss any of my fights. I'm an upcoming fighter who's uh, gonna show everyone that, you know, I'm here to fight. How's everything coming along here with the business at the CM Boxing Stables? It's, it's good. Uh, we're growing little by little. We got about uh, 80 students right now, so okay. it's growing. Good, good. Thank you for your time, Carlos. Always Thank enjoying. You. A pleasure talking to you. Uh, we'll be seeing you soon. Thank, Thank you. you.